I had been working like a mad woman all year long. This year I had started my own business and I was constantly trying to improve myself and my company. I had done so much over so little time and I was burnt out. I did not even want to look at another phone or email. I decided this Christmas I would forego the usual heading home for a big family affair. I needed to get away, preferably somewhere with a free drink and umbrella. I shut my website down with a quick close for the holidays, everywhere anyone would possibly look for me. I ran to the mall and bought myself a brand new bathing suit. If I was going to do this, I wanted to go all out. I called my family and let them know that I was just about to buy my ticket. Of course I got the, oh no, we sure are going to miss you. You sure you can't at least come for a day? Nope. I already bought my bathing suit. I was going. I booked my ticket and packed my bags. Cruise ship, here I come. I stood in the usual long lines and rolled my suitcase up to the desk. I stopped abruptly, my eyes raking through the crowd. I thought I saw my sister. I briefly thought maybe she came to see me off? But I must have just saw someone who looked like her. It's bound to happen with this many people crowded in here, and most wearing the same Hawaiian shirt. I let it drop from my thoughts and got on the ship, my favorite part coming up. Welcome home, Celia, announced a crew member as I walked through the entrance of the ship, all of the crew members smiling and clapping towards me as I made my way through the line. I knew the first thing that I had to do, even before going to my room, was the buffet. Oh my goodness, carbs galore. I knew I was going to eat it all before I left. I grabbed everything that I had never heard of or tried before and sat down. When I had filled myself to the breaking point, I unbuttoned my pants and made my way to my room. I had splurged on a balcony room and was very excited to watch the ship depart from my room. I reached my floor and could hear a huge commotion going on down the hall. Secretly hoping this large gaggle of people would be nowhere near my room, I turned the corner. Standing outside my room door stood all of my family.